Where am I? Day one. Could be nice. Maybe I should keep a diary too. Day one. Just moved in. So that's the room. Not much here, just a few pieces of furniture. Found a diary too. Mostly empty. One diary entry though. Don't know where it came from or who wrote it. Decided to keep this diary just in case I go insane, you know. Day two. Something interesting happened today. Food arrived while I was asleep. Not much variety. Just some lettuce and carrots. At least whoever is keeping me here is providing me with some sort of food. No matter how bland. Day 3. I was searching the room today, seeing if there was a way out. Didn't find much initially. No doors or windows that open. The only one in the room is locked, so no way through that. The wardrobe is intriguing though. I tried opening the doors, but they're locked. Can't force them open either. The door is locked, but I might be able to open it. I have to. I managed to open the wardrobe today. There was a note scratched into the back. It said, get out. It must have been left by the same person who left the diary. After I found it, I scoured the room for more. There was another that I found behind the cabinet. The wardrobe is strange. It was locked a few days ago. I used a pocket knife to pick the lock. After I opened it, I found outside the room to be a desert wasteland. No sign of any life in the distance. No buildings or people. I ventured out of the room a few feet, but I found the room was being guarded by an abomination. It was a giant cat. The thing chased me back inside the room and I barely closed the door before I heard it and thud into it. Now I know what is outside, I must devise a plan to get out. Even if I have to kill it, I must get out. Day 6. This is my final diary entry. I am done with this room. I have my pocket knife. Although it is small, it should still be useful. This is my final stand. This diary has become my only friend. I shall see you on the other side.